So to make it quick, short, long story quick, I got the new Thanos. Not only did I get the Thanos, but they only had two and they had not been on the shelf yet because I didn't have a place to put it yet. So I got myself one as well as my friend Justin and I skipped on this. Whenever they announced that this was coming out, I completely skipped on it because I didn't care too much because I love the Walmart version. I love that Walmart Thanos. Once I've, now that I've seen this, I'm so glad I picked it up. It looks great and I can't wait to sit and compare these two for you guys. So we're about to rip into that once I get home. Hey guys, now that I've made it home, we can unbox this Thanos and talk about it. I'm definitely going to compare it to this Walmart Thanos. So with this Walmart Thanos, all right, I absolutely love this action figure. This is one of those action figures where you spend $20 on it. Some people get it for cheaper. Some have to pay a little bit more. It has a ton of value. Like you can display it. It looks great mint on card. It looks amazing on your shelf. It has amazing sculpt. The paint is eh. If you haven't seen my video for the top 10 Marvel Legends of all time, link. This one is like top five, and he's been out for almost four years now, so we are in need of an update. The packaging on this figure is sick. Like, I don't want to open this up, but I gotta. So we're about to go ahead and cut into it. Before we get into the detail of it, everyone knows this comes with a cutout of the throne which is super great i hope they do more backgrounds because i'm going to keep this just for the background normally i would throw away but now a is staying with me so when you take it out and this is what you're pulling out and you just see that throne as the background there's a whole galaxy scene i already know it's gonna be good i haven't opened it up to expand it yet but that's the throne and what a beautiful background that is like even though it's just something easily printed, this this is infinitely better than any just blue basic background or a red X. Like Hasbro, this is the way. I'm gonna start with the the King Thanos head sculpt because that's what I'm most excited for out of this package. The camera doesn't pick it up accurately; it's not in focus. But words don't describe how beautiful this head sculpt is Let's see if it picks that up the colors on this guy is so good mine has all kinds of paint issues though i'm not quite sure what's going on with these square feet but man he's got some small feet they are itty bitty compared to the rest of his body it's comical even though i was making jokes about his small itty bitty feet you can pose this guy just as easy as the Juggernaut Marvel Legends figure, which is amazing. He is incredible balance. Like, I just love that pose. Like, he is he is ready to come get you. Like, all I need is my little 80th Iron Man right here. And... All right, about to do the head swap. Ooh. You know what? Initially, I did not like the jackhammer joint, but I've gotten used to him. I love this system. It makes it better. This head sculpt, it, this is a big head sculpt. It's much larger than the old one, right? All right, guys, and being totally transparent with this review, initially when I started off, this Walmart, I love that figure. And I was a skeptic. I didn't think this was worth 30, but easily a top three greatest Marvel legend of all time. Thanos figure, I hope it was informative to you, but more than anything, I really hope that it'll persuade you as someone who did not want the figure to begin with,
just how your Thanos is supposed to be in your display. By all means, let me know what you think in the comments, and please educate me on G.I. Joe, because I would love to learn. Thank you guys, and stay safe.